Hello, it's Adrian. How are you doing today? And so I'm back with a new haul and a strategy toward the whole Christmas holiday. And as you can see, if you've been watching YouTube or watching TikTok, all of the holiday sets are landing and everybody is just sort of like, what? And so everybody's running around in circles and getting stressed out and yeah it's already starting so um, my first tip as far as a strategy for going ahead and um, dealing with the sets is to go ahead and go shopping and uh, Alta Sephora Alta in Target Sephora in Kohl's or Sephora in JCPenney um, you know there are all sorts of places where you can go and actually see these new makeup sets swatch them if you want to in a lot of cases and just be able to get an idea if it's actually something that you would want to go ahead and purchase and maybe plan on going shopping with a couple of friends and just going window shopping and not getting anything because that's a lot of it to FOMO sets in fear of missing out and then all of a sudden you're you know coming home with 90 packages so do a fun friends out and just go out for a couple of hours and window shop and make a pact with you know your friends that you're not going to buy anything and you'll go home and think it over before you do and that usually helps a lot and it helps you kind of weed out stuff that you saw on TV that you thought was going to be amazing and it isn't or you know be able to see something that you may not have um, may not have even considered and you know you walk in the store and it blows you away so uh, I guess my next tip is to go through the stuff that you already have and um, I actually have a couple of Charlotte Tilbury. Uh, these are the mini lipsticks in the mini pack that she puts out during the holiday season. And she's putting one out again this year. And so I still have some lipsticks left. And so I probably need to check and see if her new one that she has coming out is actually going to have the same colors or the same colors that I still have and um, if it's really going to benefit me with a new color or two to go ahead and pick up that pack again or you know if you're running low on something that you really like and the pack is coming out again this year then you can re-get it so yeah that's always another good tip. Um, these are some of the rare uh, beauty minis, and these aren't from this year's packet, but these are from um, years gone by. And like I said, I still have um, this one. I'm down to about here on this one, and this one I still have like up to here. So um, from what I've heard, and I d have not seen, I, I did go out shopping. I bought a couple of things. But um, yeah, go through you know what you already have. These were the mini size from a couple of years ago. Um, definitely with this one, we've heard that these are kind of small this year. So you might want to go ahead and you know see if you already have the colors or go ahead and um, you know check it out in store um, you can even ask you know someone at Alter Sephora to open up a pack for you so that you can see the actual size of the product um, but I mean that's the downside of it the good side of it is that there are always packs that just go ahead and blow you away the LYS the pack they did last year with their blushes I mean I've used these all throughout the year and I think that they are pretty amazing. Um, this is, and I hope they come out with one for this year because I would definitely get it. This is their unforgettable shade, and it's really, really pretty cream. And so, um, yeah, there's also going to be a whole bunch of duping going on, and that always happens. We know that happens. Um, with this one, this is one of the hard candy melts, and you can go ahead and pick these up 
at Walmart for between about five and six dollars. This one is my type and um, they're said to be dupes for the Tarte Maracucha. And this also happens to be what I have on today. I haven't tried one of these before, but you know what? I actually haven't tried the Maracucha lips uh, by Tarte. But, I mean, this gives me an idea, uh, since so many people have said that it's a dupe, of what those are like. And I can trade out for 5 to $6, see if I like it, and see if I want to get the pack of four that they're offering this year. And, um, let's see. The other one that I was going to go ahead and suggest is Glowing Lips by um, ColourPop, because this has... Uh, this their lavender shade and this has a formula that's a lot like the Maracucha Juicy Lips as well. So, I mean, I know that they've been both, both of these have um, gotten a reputation as a dupe for the Maracucha Juicy Lips. Um, there's also, you know, stuff that's been coming out all year long. Uh, these Elf Halo Glow. I uh, just picked up Berry Radiant, and that's what I have on my face today, along with a uh, new one I picked up from Essence, which is, let's see, this one is Berry Cheeks. So, um, and these were on sale. These are a new product, pretty much. They came out this year, and instead of being six ninety nine, they're on sale for four fifteen or four ninety, and um, or at least they were at Ulta when I was there. And so um, definitely look for the products that you were interested in during the year because a lot of times they'll be on sale because everybody is now trained, you know, to go out and get the new uh, the new value sets. And um, these Elf Halo Glow Wands are pretty cool and they're nine dollars a piece instead of what they're duping which is the Charlotte Tilbury which runs at about forty dollars a piece so I mean there are some really good savings out there um, and then you can also look for uh, brands that are known for duping products that probably in the fall if they're gonna do a whole bunch of dupes uh, they're gonna put them out now and one of those companies will Elf and Halo are both those kind of companies, and you can get those at um, Alta. You can get them at uh, Walmart and Walgreens and CVS, you know, all those places. And Essence just did a new brow, and I have it on today. And I picked it up, and I think it was like $3.99. So, yeah, definitely look to these companies that do the dupes because you can, I mean, this whole three month season, not only is it about trying the new stuff that's coming out that the companies are releasing, but it's about restocking for a lot of us on stuff that we that we just need. And if I can restock and save a few bucks, you know, it's not a bad thing. Um, also, there are some companies that haven't actually gone ahead and listed um, any of their uh, at least Christmas holiday sort of things or winter holiday things. Uh, ColourPop has stuff out for Halloween, but it doesn't have stuff out for Christmas yet. I did pick this up and I had this on as well, this Sunset Strip. And this is one of the ones that is uh, one of the new cream ones from um, ColourPop. So what I have on is going to be actually these three right here so I have these three blushes on uh, plus a ColourPop highlighter this one is in seismic so yeah that's what I have on here as far as my cheeks and um, ColourPop is another one that it's over at Target and if you want to get basics you know over there stock up um, if you're running out of uh, blush, concealer, highlighter, uh, brow products, mascara, you know, the the basic stuff. 
um, definitely go ahead and do one of these and also don't be afraid to try different colors because that's kind of why they're putting out these sets you know to see if to see if it's gonna sell and so this color which is really dark um, yeah a lot of people probably would have advised me don't do it don't do it because you're too light but you know this is the time of year also to try some of the fun stuff and to see if uh, color works on you or you know that kind of thing as well so as far as what I have on um, for my base I went ahead and did the Super Goop Glow Oil and SPF 50 and the e.l.f. Um, this is the Halo Glow Filter and Fair One so that's what I have on for my base. Um, as far as the foundation today um, I did go ahead and use the Oma C in uh, T2 so it's Fair Lady 2. Uh, Oma Sharon C it's not at my Walmart anymore, but I went on the OMA website and OMA by Sharon C, uh, the whole line that's going to be about half the price of the high end OMA line is still on their website. So um, I don't know what's going on with that line right now, but that's uh, what I found out. And um, let's see, as far as moving on here, I'm kind of bouncing around, and yeah, I know. I'm bouncing around. Uh, MAC. So I have the MAC bronzer on and this is in the Radiant uh, Light Rosy. And this is one of my favorite products. I'm going to be going ahead and keeping an eye out to see if it goes on sale. It's still a new product, but you know, since they're bringing out, MAC has a holiday kit coming out too. Who knows? They may put some of my favorites on sale. And as far as what I did on the eyes, um, Alta has been having their fall sale. It's not the 21 Days of Beauty, but it's their fall sale that they do after that. And um, went ahead and picked up the Juvia's Culture 2, and yeah, it was on sale. And it has a whole bunch of fun stuff and some really gorgeous colors. It has some duochromes in it and multichromes. And so I'm going to go ahead and be back in one moment, and I'll do a whole little, since they're so popular this year, we'll go ahead and do a whole little section on them as well. <clears throat> okay, so I went ahead and swatched uh, the shimmers from... The Culture 2 palette by Juvia's Place. And a whole bunch of these are duochromes and multichromes. And I'm not sure how much we're going to be able to tell here. Let's see. I can get a little bit closer here. Uh, from my swatches. But there are ways to go ahead and get multichromes and duochromes without paying an arm and a leg because if you watch YouTube or TikTok you'll find and Instagram you'll find that everybody is saying that the uh, <clears throat> that the reason why you know the indie palettes the prices are so high is because everybody wants multi-crumbs and duochromes in there and um, just the to go ahead and get the products to make the multi-crumbs and the duochromes it just costs it costs money and so that's why they raise the price of pallets and indie pallets can be you know up to 70 80 100 and over a hundred dollars and um, so they can be a lot more expensive than high-end so uh, as far as going ahead and trying out multi-crumbs or duochromes jo um, I'm dropping all sorts of stuff aren't I? Juvia's Place always does those. That's one of the reasons that when I saw this palette on sale, I was like, yeah, I'm picking that up. I really am. So it was $22 instead of $39, and yeah, I picked it up. And um, this one that's still available is Garden of Juvia's, and I listed it as my favorite summer palette. 
and it makes my camera go a little bit crazy. But yeah, there are a lot of duochromes and multichromes in here as well. And so again, you can try some duochromes and multichromes without spending 50, 60, 80, or over $100 for a palette. Um, Profusion has a whole multi or metachrome palette. And this one is available on their website. I think it's also available on the Walmart website. But you can go ahead and order this one. The outside ring is all mattes, and then the inside room or the inside circle is all duochromes and multichromes. And so uh, this one in the very middle. So yeah, there are definite ways to go ahead and try multichromes, including ColourPop. And I think these sell for about $12 regularly but they do go on sale and as far as the way they look yeah that was what went well I don't know where it went at this point it's probably under the chair but yeah these are available as two and um, so there are definite ways to try multi-crumbs without without having to invest you know in a palette or in a really expensive palette. So as far as what I have on here, <clears throat> I went ahead and started with this color, which is matte. I put this on the outer corner. Um, then I did go ahead and use uh, this one, Batik, down here. And it is definitely a duochrome. It has green and blue, I think. And I think it's on a black base. That's why it's harder to tell. Um, and then I went ahead and used some of this color uh, right on the inner corner. And a little bit of the Emeride eyeliner as well. This is the way that the look came out. Oh, and I put, to blend out this one, I used a little bit of this color up here. So this is right. Uh, right under the brow and so um, yeah I would definitely say if you don't know what you like in the multi-chromes definitely pick up some of the palettes that have multi-chromes in them um, to see and there are some reasonably priced ones um, I think this one's about $15 this one's about $25 like I said this one usually runs to about $39 and the ColourPop these individual ones run at about 12 but again ColourPop does sales so you can get one of these during the, one of their sales and um, that's another thing is that you know if there's something that you're looking at go to the website go to the Juvia's Place website they're always doing sales and if Alt isn't doing you know doesn't have this one on sale check yeah, check their website. And um, let's see, what else do I want to say? I don't know, but I have just gabbed on and on and on. So I hope some of this has been helpful to you. And uh, FOMO happens to everybody, and we all go this time of year. So um, I hope it's helped and not hurt. <laughs> and so I'll go ahead and see you later, and have a good day. Bye.